Hello and welcome to Bitsbox World, builds made easy. So did you know that each month you can get a free miniature? Warhammer Community gives the update. Get a taste of Neurogaunt Swarm with this month's free miniature. Every month you can visit your local Warhammer store to collect a miniature of the month for free. And from the 2nd of March you'll be able to claim a free Neurogaunt. So these guys look pretty cool, going to be in the Tyranid army there. These dim inutive Tyranids are vicious little beasts on their own. All snapping jaws and nasty hisses en masse. They are a swarm of sharp claws that swarm enemies to protect their hives, more vulnerable node creatures. While relaying synapsis signals further, these miniatures will be available while stocks last and they may differ from the ones pictured as the Warhammer community is saying. Ask your local store staff how you can claim one. So I've just popped down to my local store to pick up my free miniature of the month. It comes in this nice awesome little box here and depending on the style you may have to clip it out of a sprue or uh, you may have to clip it out of a join sprue. These ones came on one of 10 little models and uh, the guy at my local store let me choose the one that I wanted. So I clipped it out in store and I've brought it home to come and build it. So this uh, comes with four pieces and uh, we just want to start having a look at them and making sure that they're ready to go together. So the first thing that I will need to be doing is um, I want to clean them up. I want to make sure that they will go nice together and there's no flash sort of that extra bit when you've clipped them out left on the model. So I use this uh, handy little pen knife here, really blunt. I've been using it for years and years and um, I just use it to scrape off any flash that I find on the edge of the model. So just giving it a bit of a clean... I think to really make your models look good, doing this level of uh, preparedness is really useful. And um, I like getting the miniatures of the month. I like uh, getting all the ones that you can collect. It might expand some of your armies. It might give you a new idea of some models to buy. And uh, also it's really good for those that aren't part of the hobby. So they get a free model that they can build in store if they want to and paint at the same time when they go into store. So it's a really good idea to help people that are new to the hobby to get involved. These guys here, this one, I do really like the Tyranids. I don't have an army myself. Uh, I've gone with the classic Space Marines and Imperial Guards, which was the old name. And um, yeah, I, I have always liked the idea of Tyranids, though. The whole sort of hive mind entity, a bit like ants or termites. They, uh, they have a really interesting concept, sending the drones in to battle and having hordes and hordes in the swarm going to overtake planets, going to destroy their enemies. So once you've cleaned everything up, if you've still got a bit of sort of layering edges or some uneven lines, you can use a file just to file that away as well. Just makes it nice and flat and nice and smooth. Okay, so the model, uh, all the edges are starting to get nice and smooth and ready for me to put together. So these ones, interestingly, these uh, little model of the month, they come with a push fit functionality. Now, I am a fan of the push fit. It makes it really easy and um, doesn't require glue, but I do like to glue them together. I've had some of my push fit models fall apart, so I've always glued them, certainly the plastic ones here. And uh, it, it, with the push fit, it just gives a nice level of security on top of the glue making them all fit together you sometimes have to with the model of the month as well figure out how it all fits together because you won't have your usual instruction manual uh, but it takes me back to when i started the hobby sort of in the early 2000s sort of 20 years ago 
where you sort of you didn't have instructions back then let me know in the comments below if uh you remember building back in the day now we've got number charts for where things are meant to fit and how they all put together whereas when i started the hobby everything had a either a similar pose or no instructions so you kind of had to work out where things went so things have advanced a lot since i started the hobby so there we go i've put it all together push fit bit of glue and there is my neuro gaunt ready for the battle so some of the other miniatures of the month that i've got i got this guy another tyranid looking really mean there with his sharp claws ready to rip space marines into pieces got this little guy as well again for the tyranid army he's got a little blaster i just love how this one looks tongue out very mean teeth bared ready for the fight here's a nice one sort of a space minotaur there very very cool could go in your chaos in a kill team but uh, i'm thinking i'm going to take off the weapons and put him in my beastman blood bowl team now this guy's really cool really like his shield very nice shape and the sword's pretty awesome uh saurus warrior also was one of the ones that i got and uh i've put him on a square base not a round base because uh age of sigmar is not my bag but i know people love it and a little rhino rhino here from uh Warmaster. they're re-releasing these and um yeah I, I might get a little army and put this rhino in that army uh also you can get space marines of how shown you the tyranids i've got this flamer here Space Marine going to take on the fight. Bring it to those nasty swarm Tyranids coming in to the battle. And then also another Space Marine. This guy is awesome. He is pretty cool. Sprayed white. So these miniatures of the month, free miniatures of the month. You can find out what is going to be coming out on the Warhammer community. Go down to the store and pick up your model really cool idea to help people get into the hobby have you picked up yours this month let me know in the comments and i'll see you soon for another video thanks for watching bits bots world builds made easy